What do you call a pile of cats? I don't know. A meow tin. You're listening to the Epic Dad Podcast, episode number one. Today, what is this thing all about? Welcome to the Epic Dad Podcast. I'm your host, Jason McCleary, and I'm here to help you create better relationships, better health, and an all-around amazing life. Each week, we feature inspiration, motivation, tools, and tricks to create the life you love. The Epic Dad Podcast is here to help you become your best self as a parent, spouse, and all-around epic human being. If you want to remove yourself from the drift and make steps to become the epic dad you always wanted to be, then this podcast is for you. Hello and welcome everyone. I am Jason McCleary and I want to thank you for taking the time to listen to this inaugural episode of the Epic Dad Podcast. I'm immensely grateful that you're here. This episode will be a relatively short one as the point of it is just to introduce you to what the podcast is all about and give you an idea of who this is for and why it exists in the first place. So what is the Epic Dad Podcast anyway? Well, I wanted to make this podcast a place to discuss how to create the best version of you, how to find yourself living more intentionally, whether that be creating better relationships with your kids, having a more fulfilling marriage with your amazing spouse, finding work or creating work that is more meaningful than just your average everyday nine to five, whatever it might be. Or maybe you want to create better health for yourself, both physically and mentally. Well, I want to have this space. We'll be meeting weekly uh, for about 20 or 30 minute podcasts with uh, discussions on Thursdays and hoping to get out a kind of shorter, more inspirational, motivational focused podcast on Mondays. For now, it's mostly going to be a solo show of just me talking about a particular topic that we're uh, interested in learning a little bit more about, but I'm hoping to bring in some more experts for interviews from time to time, things on habit forming, creating discipline, even some mental health issues as well. So who am I to deliver this epic content to you? Well, I'm a daddy to three amazing children, ages eight, almost 10 and uh, 12 at the time of this recording. For the last 13 and a half years, I've been a husband to an amazing woman and the best partner I could have ever asked for. For the last 10 or so years, I've been fascinated with how people achieve things that they do and maybe more importantly, why they don't. And so I've seen people, including myself from time to time, wanting to lose weight, for instance, and they, they read all the diet books, they listen to all the podcasts, they buy the exercise equipment, or maybe they even get a gym membership. And they go strong for a couple weeks or months, and then they fall off. And this happens from time to time. Or yet worse, they don't even get started. They, they feel like they've tried everything and they'll fail before they even start. And this is, just isn't for weight loss. Um, talking about people who are wanting to create their own business, starting a different hobby, or wishing for a better relationship with their kids or spouse. They always have the best intentions, but they can't seem to get off the ground or get started. And so I wanted to know why. Why do we have the knowledge to do things but not follow through? Why do we say we want to lose weight, but we continue to sit in front of the Xbox with a bag of chips and a bottle of Mountain Dew? Why do we put off starting a business when we feel so passionate and energized when we think about doing it? So what this podcast will be all about is what I've learned and what I've tried myself. Different ways to create new habits and overcome bad ones. Why we don't follow through or even get started sometimes how to be more intentional with your time, and how to create a better relationship with your loved ones, and how to create a better relationship with yourself. So who is this podcast for? Well, to get into that, I'm going to tell you a story of a man named Jim. Jim's in his mid-30s, he's slightly overweight. He gets up early every morning, gets himself presentable, and heads to work. He sits in traffic, listening to podcasts, dreaming about things that he wishes he could do, starting his own business, getting out of this soul-sucking job, having more time to sit with his family and his wife. He works hard at an okay job, but doesn't feel fulfilled by working for someone else's dream. He gets along all right with everyone at work as well, but no real relationships there either. He gets paid okay, but it's really just enough to get by, not really get ahead, not give his family the life that he really wants to. And so he heads home, more traffic, more podcasts, more wishing, more dreaming. And as soon as he gets home, almost instantly he has to get dinner ready for the family. He's too tired or uninspired to eat healthy, so it becomes the same five meals week after week. He helps his wife clean up after dinner, 
gets the kids' lunches ready for school the next day, and then gets them to bed. He gets up so early that he doesn't have enough energy for much of anything else and usually falls asleep watching TV next to his amazing wife. Just to do it all over again the next day and the next day. He wishes he could have more time for her, for the kids, for his dreams. He knows that he could have a better life, but feels stuck. Does any of this or all of it resonate with you? It was definitely me not too long ago, but I decided that an ordinary life just wasn't going to cut it anymore. So I put a plan in place for better health, finding ways to be more intentional with spending time with my wife, my kids, and a few of my own passions. And so that is the plan for this podcast to talk about the ways in which we can become better versions of ourselves and find the magic in everyday life. Maybe you want to discover ways to be more present for your family. This podcast is for you. And maybe you want to wake up feeling fully alive every day and want to see how to do that. This podcast is for you. Maybe you want to start your own business to feel like your work means something to the world. This podcast is for you. Or maybe you don't want to build your own business. You just want to have an amazing life with your kids and wife. And this podcast is for you too. So I hope that you continue to join us every week to hear more insight about how to create the best life that you possibly could. And with that, I want to put out the quote of the day. When we love, we always strive to become better than we are. And when we strive to become better than we are, everything around us becomes better too. It's a quote from Paulo Coelho from The Alchemist. So thanks for listening. And remember, if you want to support what I'm doing here, then share, subscribe, and leave a review on iTunes, Stitcher, or wherever else you get your podcast feed. And until then, I hope you have an epic day. 